awesome. Today I got Clear Vision Deluxe Sunglasses. I'm going to try these out and see how well they work. We got these with uh, a couple of other things that we bought from our um, our friend here that we have we we uh, sell with. So we, I thought I'd try these and see how well they work. I'm going to try them at nighttime too. So um, they're supposed to be good for driving and at night with the lights, which would help me a lot. Um, also, it's supposed to be very clear for um, daylight for the sun. And you can also, if you have to wear glasses, you can put these on top of your glasses. They do do really good that way. Um, it says it reduces eye strain, glare free, improves night vision, and light weighted. So I'm going to take these out and we'll try them out and see what we got. I'm going to bring it down a little bit here so we can see what we got. Now I have $10 on them. That's what we're selling them for. But um, these are at Walmart. I believe they're run around $20. Um, you can also get them at other stores. I've seen them in. But they're much more expensive. We didn't pay $10 for them. We got them in a bundle. You get two pairs. Two pairs. Sorry, I can't speak. So that's kind of nice. And you each get a little, little pouch. That's really nice. I like that. And you can put your little sunglasses in there and keep them nice. That's nice. And it gives you a little bit of directions here. Warning before using these. Make sure you can see clearly while wearing them. Um, and I'm just going to show you this so it does give you a warning thing on here. You can freeze it and read if you're interested in these. Um, yeah, I am not, I, I was interested in them because my eyes are very sensitive. I have blue eyes and my, my eyes have been sensitive for years. So I have a hard time. And I should be wearing sunglasses all the time and I don't. So. There we go, that's what they look like. Oops, sorry. There you go, that's what they look like. I'm gonna take them out in the sun and we'll go outside and see how well they work out there. I'll be right back. Okay, we're outside. It's about three in the afternoon, so the sun's kinda of not real bright, but it's, it's going behind the tree, of course. So, but do I see a difference? Eh, I don't know. It's very clear. It is nice. I want the sun more. Um, let me see. I might have to go in the backyard to get more of the sun. Be back. Okay. It's kind of dark in the backyard, but I did find it. Oh yeah, here comes the sun now. I can look right at the sun. And it doesn't seem to bother me as much. Um, you know, it seems pretty good. I think it's clear. Oh yeah, you can see a difference. You really can. I can see that tree branch over there. Ah, uh, doesn't look good. Anyways, yeah. So what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna get Shaber to help me and when it gets dark out, we're gonna go for a ride in the truck and I'm gonna wear them at night to see how well I can tell the difference with the, the lighting. Um, so, We'll, we'll have to wait until it gets dark out and we'll be able to finish this video. But yeah, oh yeah, the sun's really out and I can look right at it. But it's, I wouldn't really want to, but you know. But it's very clear. Yeah, I see a difference. I like them. Very nice. Okay, so stay tuned and when it gets dark out, we'll go for a ride. Okay guys, here we are. It is now nighttime, and we're going to try out these glasses and see how well it works against other cars' lights. Because I really have bad, a hard time with sensitivity at nighttime, and so do many people. So we'll see how well these work. If they work, I'll be using these all the time. So here we go. You need to leave that light on, right? Okay. So, 
get a picture of the super moon? We're having the super moon tonight. It's a pretty one. It's big. Okay, here we go. We had to leave the light on so you can see. We have Bruno with us. He wanted to come for a ride. So you'll hear him back there doing his doggy stuff. <laughs> oh, here we go. So what do you think, babe? I don't know. I don't have them on. They fit pretty good. They're comfortable. I don't think they're very fashionable, but they'll do. Especially at night. There's where we set up. Yep, that's where we set up. Mm -hmm. Oh well, so far. Let's see. We'll go out to the main road here so we can see a little bit more. More cars out here. My back roads. Everything. Most of them look very yellow in these glasses. Yeah, well, this thing is not focusing. No? No. Mm. There very we go. bad. Very bad. So, maybe I'll straighten up. Am I going to turn it off and turn it back on? No. Did the lane get messed up from the heat? <laughs> Now those are very bright lights there. I can look at them and they don't seem to bother me yeah. at all. I'm not supposed to look at the lights. Well, I know. You're supposed to look at this white line over here. I see the white line. Well, when you got bright lights coming at you, you're supposed to look at that white line. But sometimes you can't and that's why I need yeah, glasses that would work better for me at Well, night. how are they so far? They seem very fine. All the, most of the lights are all like a yellow tinted See? when you wear them and then you have the bright white ones you can tell people that have the the brighter headlights than that now if i take them off oh yeah i see a difference here you can see well not until cars are coming what is going on here workers Well, I saw somebody cross the road in a dark. I'm trying to see what's going on. There he is right there. There's without him, and here is with him. Right now in the daytime, they're very crisp. Yeah, they are very. There bothers my eyes. So I had their hair just bright on. So what do you think of them? Um, I don't like them at night. But don't. my vision's not real good. Or I mean not real bad where I would need them. Because lights, headlights don't bother me. Yeah, see, they never used to with me, but now they do. Sometimes they're really bad. And I can, you know, I mean, I try not to look at them, but... It does take the glare away. You can see yeah. it through the camera somewhat. Yeah. It does help. See, look at those. Those are very, very bright. Well, sunglasses will do the same thing, but it's really, really dark in regular sunglasses. These kind of just take the glare away. All right. Headlights. 
You've got plenty on here. Hmm? You can tell on here. Can you? Yeah. Yeah, you got plenty of light here. Thank you. Alright. filming you wearing sunglasses. Uh, uh, I'm not wearing sunglasses, I'm wearing night glasses. I wear my sunglasses at night. Oops. Right. Copyright. Uh. 8.30. That's at 9.30, but it's 8.30. Oh, okay. I just never set the clock. But it is 8.30. There you go. It does help, I think. Let me see him now. Okay, it does cut down on the glare. Mm-hmm. Yeah. There you go. Sure does. Cool. What do you think? I like them. I really do. I have to wear them a few times to really get to, to know them, but I think they would help a lot at night. Applebee's. Applebee's. Over oh, down this road. Pleasant Grove Road, huh? That's not bad. Not bad. Rust tank making a new turn here. That rust tang was making an illegal U-turn. This is the darker road. So. Yeah. But here in Florida, they encourage uh, they encourage U-turns, don't they? <laughs> I guess so. No, I'm serious. You can, unless it's posted, you can pretty much make. They actually have lanes, like yeah. say a lane right here to turn left, and there's nothing there. Mm -hmm. That's because that's a U-turn lane, so you can turn around. Because sometimes you have no choice but to make a U-turn, so they do encourage U-turns down here, and it saves a lot of time. In Ohio, you do a U-turn, you're asking, getting a ticket. Yeah. Yep, no exceptions. So but, you can't do a no, no U-turn at all? No. Wow. You know, down here you can do a U-turn unless it's posted no U-turn. Right. Some places on the highway it says no U-turn, but if there's not a sign, you are more than welcome to do a U-turn. Huh. I don't know what it is in Canada anymore. Cold. <laughs> you know that. So I'll just keep this rolling and you can cut out what you don't want. Okay. <laughs> All right. Yeah. I'm just, you know, showing them the plight of the city. You seeing all this plight, kids? Bang! Roll them up. Now, see, that car, if I didn't have these on, would bothered me. That was a movie reference. Wouldn't have. That was National Lampoon's <laughs> Vacation, the first one. How do you remember that stuff? I don't have time in my brain to remember that Because those are the best movies stuff. in the world is National Lampoon. I have other things to worry They were about. going through, um, what was it, Chicago. Chicago? They were going through Chicago, yeah. Mm -hmm. he, he took the wrong, the wrong turn. Who took the wrong turn? Clark. Oh, well that's not good. Okay, so... I have to figure out where I'm at. Do you know where we are? Yes, I do. Where are we? Just mm -hmm. went in a big circle, really.
You know where. Yeah, that's right over there on the other side of that truck is where I filmed that old bar that's falling in. Yeah. Not even a bar anymore. Well, no. I said that old bar. Oh. I doubt if I can see it, but right there. Yep. That old that's an old bar or pub or restaurant or something. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I did that. I didn't really go in and in it because there, you could see everything from where I was at, you know? Mm-hmm. There's a bakery outlet. Okay, everyone. Um, so as you know, I had to, I had to end at a certain spot because what has happened is we had an accident. So that's all I'm allowed to say. Say so. As soon as we can, we'll have videos up. So um, of it. So hopefully, you'll we'll explain a little bit more later on down the road. But right now, we're not allowed to talk about. It. So, I do have my glasses with me. I do like them. Um, so, yes, it's been a few days. And that's because of that. So, um, yeah, I, I give these... Uh, out of five, I'd probably give them a three. Um, I would probably... The, the one thing I tried to do during the day, I was when I was working, I wore them. Um, on Tuesday and I wore them and the problem was that I have my GPS on my phone that I used to get from one patient to the next so I could not see it very well with these on so I was like having to put them up on my head and take them down and put them up and take them down which can be a pain in the butt so um, but I think I would most likely like these at night time so um, it really it really takes that glare off you know and as you can see in the video um, when uh, Shea Bear put it up and down in front of the camera you could see the difference so it does help it really does so I, I, I probably give it a three okay and anyway so as soon as I have another video coming soon um, so watch out for that one um, and we'll stay tuned and hopefully I'll try to get this one up tonight. So y'all have a good day and the rest of it. And hopefully you'll have a good Valentine's Day because Valentine's Day is tomorrow, I guess. So everybody, happy Valentine's Day. So monkey says she's out for now. Bye, y'all.